My wife was ashamed of my job, and she left me in my difficult times. The ending of the story is great. My wife was ashamed of my job, she even refused to recognize me in public. Hi, I'm David and this is my story. A year ago, I was working as Asalis representative. I was married for two years to my wife Jennifer. Jennifer was very beautiful and loved me. I thought the love was real, but when I lost my job, she changed. Our company had suffered a huge loss during the lockdown. They fired almost half of the employees to cut costs. I was one of the ones who lost the job. When I told my wife about it, she was furious. How can you lose your job? She shouted at me. I had no answer for her. I started looking for alternative jobs, but no one was ready to hire me. I was hopeless, not because I had no job, but because I had no support at home. My wife started nagging me all the time. I wanted to get a job somehow, just to stop her from nagging all the time. But I failed to get a similar job, so, I opted for low-grade jobs. I started working as a janitor. I cleaned the garbages on Thoreau to make some living. I used to leave home in suits. My wife thought I was working as a sales representative again. But I was just cleaning garbages. One day I got caught red-handed. My wife went to shopping, she saw him working in the streets nearby. She was furious. She was with her friends. She just refused to recognize me in front of her friends, my presence disgusting my wife. I went home and told her the truth, I thought my wife would understand. But she didn't. She stopped talking to me. She even stopped touching me or sleeping beside me. I can't sleep with a janitor, she said. I just continued with my work. One day one of my wife's friends approached me. Her name was Jessica. Jessica offered me a job. She said, hey David, I'm starting a business off baking pastries. I need someone to help me with the delivery, can you help me with that? I wasn't making enough money as a janitor, so, I accepted the offer. I was cleaning the roads in the morning, and delivering pastries in the evening. When my wife got to know that I worked for her friend, she felt embarrassed. She came to me and shouted, why do you have to keep embarrassing me? First you embarrassed me by working as a janitor, now you want to embarrass me more. By working under my friend, Jennifer left me that day. She said that she couldn't live with such a loser like me. I knew it was bound to happen. I kept working as a janitor and a delivery guy. Jessica and I were working hard to get the pastry business going. After working hard for months, we finally succeeded. We opened a bakery of our own. I left the job as a janitor, because Jessica had offered me 50 of the steaks at the bakery. Our bakery became famous so quickly, the dark days were over. On the other hand, Jessica and I become very close friends. In fact, we were more than friends. I had moved on from my wife. Jessica was there to support me during the dark days. My wife never supported me, but she did come back to make up things. When she saw that I was succeeding, I refused to get back to her. Real love will never leave you when you are down. If someone loves you, they'll support you through your ups and downs. If your love can't be your strength during hard times, just leave. Today we own 14 bakeries in 3 cities. Jessica and I've been married happily for 4 years. We have a 1-year-old son. 
it's a complete family.